Breast cancer is the most common cancer in the UK. Approximately 25% of patients present with an aggressive form of breast cancer, which is characterized by increased expression of human epidermal growth receptor 2, or HER2. Now, patients who overexpress HER2 have greater tumor progression and poorer overall survival. Fortunately, these patients can benefit from trastuzumab, which is a monoclonal antibody directed towards inhibiting HER2 receptors. Trastuzumab reduces tumor recurrence and significantly improves survival. Unfortunately, patients receiving trastuzumab also have a greater risk of developing congestive heart failure, and if some symptoms become severe, treatment has to be stopped. Congestive heart failure has been thought to occur due to damage to the cardiomyocytes in the heart. However, in the present article, Professor Amtulkar Michael, Professor George Kitas and I engage readers in a discussion about the impact of trastuzumab on promoting abnormal blood vessel function, a phenomena termed endothelial dysfunction. We also discuss how endothelial dysfunction contributes to congestive heart failure. The article also provides suggestions for future research utilising several non-invasive assessments of blood vessel function in breast cancer patients who receive trastuzumab. It is hoped that the information will help clinicians better understand the cardiotoxic effects of trastuzumab and improve patient care in the future.